Have you ever wanted to learn nodes, procedural materials, and compositing in Blender? Well, look no further. This course right here is perfect for you. Not only are we going to be learning all of the shader nodes and all of the compositing nodes, but we're going to be using them in a practical way to create some awesome procedural materials and compositions. Now, who am I? My name is Alex Cordobard, and for the last 12 or so years, I've been doing and teaching 3D arts and animation and Blender to tens of thousands of people. I have over 50,000 students right here on Udemy and several bestsellers as well. Have you ever wanted to make your own materials from scratch or composite your render so that it stands out and looks like an awesome render? Well, that's what nodes are for, and in this course, we will cover all of the shader nodes and all of the compositing nodes. If you've ever wanted to learn nodes, this is the course for you. By the end of it, you will know every node there is and how to use it for your projects. Now, if you know nothing about nodes, don't worry, as this course will guide you step by step through every node and with every video building on the last one. In each video, we will not only learn a new node and all of its options, but how to use it in a practical way to create materials or compositing. The course is best watched in order, but if you want to quickly learn what a node does for a project, you can just search for that particular node and video, as every node is broken down to one node per video. Now we will be creating some awesome things from volcanoes, walls, rust, snow, rock, grass, cloth, metal, wood, plastic, and much, much more. With every shader node we learn, we will use it in a practical way to create a material or texture. After we learn all of the shader nodes and create some awesome materials, we will make a full scene using just procedural nodes and everything we've learned. With this scene, we will then go to the compositor and learn all of the compositing nodes, their options, and how to practically use them for compositing. By the end of this course, not only will you know all the shader nodes and all the compositing nodes, but you will be able to use them practically in your own projects to create your very own materials and compositions. So with that, click the button and get the course. I know you'll love it. I poured my heart and my soul into it. So I'll see you in the course. Ciao for now. Au revoir.